Hello to all my pretty CEOs. I'm Ari with prettyceo.com and today I'm going to talk about uh, attention deficit disorder because I definitely have it and I finally got medicated which is something that has really changed my life and has um, been very positive for my business. So um, today I wanted to first talk about um, how important it is that <clears throat> if you feel like you're not at your full potential that you know one of the things that told me um, right away that I knew that I had it is is they say on the questionnaire when you're trying to figure out if you have ADD or not one of the things that you check off is do you frequently zone out in front of your fa uh, family or friends and uh, that is like the key thing that all my friends are like are you always zoning out I'm talking to you and it's like no, nobody's listening um, so obviously you know when I have employees that are like hey you know Ari you need to get some ADD medicine because we can't focus on what you want us to do and you know you have a hundred things going at the same time and you can't um, channel your energy so you know I think that there have been a lot of successful people with ADD and um, if you have ADD it's no big deal just definitely if you um, can see a doctor about it and they can you know tell you you know whether you're going to be medicated or not they can give you some tips as to what you can do to improve your life and improve your potential which is really I think the key word here because um, I feel like my potential has skyrocketed now that um, I'm on medication so let me just kind of go over um, how the whole process went basically I went to go see a doctor and you know answer all these questions yes um, you know I'm like why didn't why didn't um, my parents noticed that I had, you know, attention deficit disorder as a kid because some doctors say that, you know, if you didn't have it as a kid, then you definitely don't have it now as an adult. Well, A, I don't really remember much of my <laughs> growing up. Not that I don't remember it, but, you know, I wasn't paying attention half the time, so my memories are a little bit more vague than most people's memories. Um, so when I, the first time I went to a doctor, they asked me, you know, do you remember, um, being, you know, do you remember school being hard when you were growing up? And I'm like, I don't remember, I, you know, so they're like, oh, you didn't have it. So, you know, I go on a couple more years and I'm like, something is wrong with me. You know, I, I can't focus. People tell me I'm zoning out. Um, I'm trying really hard. You know, I know I'm really talented, but I can't get it together, which, you know, it, it's really hard when you, when you know that you have a lot of potential, but you can't reach it. Um, so finally I went to another doctor and, um, explained all these things. So they, they um, diagnosed me with um, attention deficit disorder, but not the hyper kind. So even though I talk a lot and I may seem really outgoing, I'm not super hyper in general. Um, but what they did was uh, they start you off obviously on the first, um, I think, well, what she did is she started me off on Ritalin on kind of a low dose. Um, and so today's blog is about Adderall versus Ritalin. Um, so the Ritalin I got, it says, um, I got the generic kind, I got 10 milligrams. So what happened when I started taking Ritalin? Okay, so I started taking it and um, I felt like I had something in my system, but I was kind of like always waiting for it to hit and I, it didn't really hit, Didn't I didn't feel anything drastic happen. Um, you have to take it three, I had to take it three times a day, which is not something that you wanna, well, that I really wanted to do because I forget a lot of the time and um, you know, it's kind of just, annoying to have to take three pills every day um, so I noticed in my personality I felt kind of zombie-ish kind of like oh out of it um, and not really focused like just kind of like um, okay should be doing something what's wrong with me I feel funny <laughs> you know so and I, I kind of felt my personality kind of like just dull dulled out um, so I didn't like the Ritalin, so I go back and I talk to my doctor and I'm like, hey, can we try something else? You know, this isn't really working. So, um, she prescribed me with Adderall and I got 20 milligram, um, tablets, time release, um, capsule. And I just have to take one in the morning and, um, it lasts all day long. So what I feel like on the Adderall is I feel completely, um, able to fulfill the tasks that I, um, tell myself I have to do in the morning and one of the things that I that's helped me is making a list the night before um, a lot of the times I wasn't able to sleep and I, I couldn't fall asleep because I was thinking of all the things I had to do the next day and then by the next day um, I'd start doing stuff and this was when I wasn't on Adderall and I would forget what the things what all the things were that I had to do so writing a list the night before is starting to help as well as the Adderall obviously <clears throat> and the Adderall it lasts 12 hours so it didn't feel like you know, I was cracked out or it didn't feel like, you know, a bunch of, like a big rush of, of 
concentratedness, if you want to say, but it was a very even, um, even feeling all throughout the day of being productive and, uh, and I, I didn't lose my personality. So, I mean, go to your doctor, see what they say, obviously, but for me, um, the Adderall worked better for my condition. So anyway, just wanted to share that experience and, uh, check back for more woman entrepreneur tips or, you know, my two cents on what have you, um, next time on prettyceo.com. See ya.